can count on continuing at five with the first day of school in Columbia County, where students and teachers got to see something a little different this year, an armed officer at every school. News Channel 6 is Ashley Campbell live in our newsroom now. And here we go, Ashley, the first year for this program. And those officers went through training last week with the Columbia County Sheriff's Office from firing guns to active threat scenarios, but they're not the only ones prepping for the worst this school year. There are some new employees walking the halls in Columbia County Middle and Elementary Schools. Tara Wood has six children who go to Columbia County Schools. It's incredibly important to me that kids, teachers, administration feel safe. High schools already had an armed officer, but now elementary and middle schools have them, and Wood says she's happy those extra safety measures are in place. They're, they're there to teach, they're there to learn, they're not, they shouldn't have to worry about taking a bullet or where to hide. The guards have gone through extensive training with their weapons and received CPR training this week. We live in a in a society now where you can't be too cautious. You don't know what's going to happen from day to day. Mm -hmm. And certainly people should be, have, be CPR trained who are, you know, have children around. And it's not just the officers getting trained. A supervisor in each school was taught what to do if an intruder ever makes its way into the building. We go from a hard lockdown to uh, alert to going actually locking down, barricading the classroom doors. Uh, and arming ourselves to be able to defend ourselves. Johnson says even though armed officers have been in the high schools for several years, the newly hired officers for middle and elementary schools will have an impact on his students as well. A lot of times if there is an emergency taking place at the elementary school level, sometimes our officer will have to go down to uh, work with administration there. Full security and training tactics for Columbia County schools that administrators hope are never used. Something else that's new this year in Columbia County Schools, students and staff have name badges. That way principals and staff can tell who belongs in the school and who doesn't. Jenny?